Hey guys, welcome to another episode of Dom's Italian. I am so excited this weekend and I was more excited last weekend when the Italian soccer team won the Euro Championship. 2,000 years ago, soccer was invented in England. And last weekend, the Italian team won the championship. So to celebrate that, I'm gonna create an anchovy pizza today. The anchovy pizza was created in the 18th century by the Napoleons. Of course, they decided to use anchovies because they were cheap and easy to preserve. And today, we still carry on that tradition. So in today's episode, please join me, grab a glass of wine, and let's enjoy this episode. Salute. And to start off this pizza, I'm gonna go through some of our ingredients. This beautiful basil, which is fragrant, fresh. This fantastic fresh tomato sauce. These bunched onions, fresh tomatoes, garlic, and of course, these beautiful anchovies. Okay, we're first gonna start off by dicing up these onions. And of course, these bunched onions, we don't wanna use these roots. They're not very tasty. So we'll cut those off and start to chop them up finely. These are very fresh and crispy, as you can hear them crunch. So that means they're gonna be very tasty. Next, we're gonna use some Spanish garlic, which I love. I prefer over any other type of garlic because they're so flavorful. So I've already peeled some and I'm just gonna to start to crush some up. You wanna make sure they're fine and not too big of a piece so that when you bite into your pizza, you're not tasting the garlic, you're just tasting the flavor. So, just before I dice and slice the tomatoes, I have to celebrate this Italian soccer win. So this is for the Italians all over the world. Cheers, salute. It's time to dice them up. And now it's time to slice some of these anchovies. We don't wanna to put too much in one area of the pizza. These are quite salty. And actually these anchovies are quite peppery. So we're gonna start dicing them up. These are so tasty. Okay guys, now it's the dough. This dough was made a couple days ago, refrigerated and left out today for a few hours to soften up. 
And now I'm gonna put it on the board and stretch it out. And I think we got the size that we want. The dough is nice and airy. It's going to be absolutely fresh when it comes out of the oven. And it's going to taste amazing with all the other ingredients. So let's keep on trucking. And now it's time to start dressing this dough. Of course, we're going to add some olive oil to help spread those flavors underneath. You always want to use quite a bit of olive oil to help distribute the flavors. We're now going to add some of this fresh tomato sauce. Let's spread it around. We want to make sure we don't go over the edges or else that will cause a big smoking uh, scenario in the oven. So we wanna be careful with that. Get it close to the edges, but not over. Okay, so now, we're going to add some of this garlic. And the next ingredient is going to be fresh basils. Pull these leaves off and add them to the tomato surface. I'm just going to rip them up by hand. I don't like to put full leaves because I just feel it doesn't really add anything. This basil smells amazing. And now it's time to add the mozzarella. Let's give it a good sprinkle all the way around the pizza. I also like to use oregano for this recipe. So I've got some nice dry oregano. We're gonna sprinkle quite a bit of that on. Another ingredient that a lot of people don't use is called this Everything Bagel Seasoning. And it seems a little odd, but it does add some nice texture and flavor to this recipe. Okay, so our next topping is gonna to be the tomatoes. We're gonna spread these around also. You want to try to grab the reddest tomatoes you can at the grocery store. They're always uh, the tastier ones. Okay, I think that's enough. And now it's time for the diced onions.
And now, the anchovies. Try not to put too many in one area because these are really salty. I know I cut these up already, but I'm gonna cut them down even further using my fingers because like I said, they're salty and you don't wanna have a salty, salty pizza. I think we got enough anchovies there and it's time to put this beautiful looking pizza in the oven okay this pizza is gonna go in the oven at 500 degrees for about 20 minutes Okay guys, I think the pizza's ready to come out, so let's do that now. Definitely, definitely ready. Look at this beautiful pizza. The crust, nice and crunchy, and yes, really hot. The juice is still simmering. Let's let that cool down before we cut it. Just a couple more ingredients we're gonna add as it's cooling. A little bit of Parmesan cheese. That's gonna add a nice little punchy flavor. And again, a little bit more oregano. And of course, I love the olive oil. We're gonna add a little bit more olive oil. Let's let it cool now. Now it's time to cut the pizza, so let's go. Looks amazing, smells amazing, and I bet it's gonna taste amazing. Just give it a second and we'll find out. Still a little bit hot, but you know what? I think I can handle it. It is hot. I'm gonna have to fold the tip over. Ready guys? One, two, three. Oh yeah. Yeah. The anchovies, onions, tomatoes, oregano, garlic. Fantastic combo. Great taste. Thanks for watching guys. Hope you enjoyed it. Till next time. Ciao.